guys and welcome back. Today I have my sister Kylie here joining me again. Yay! For part two of my Harry Potter series. Kylie is a Hufflepuff. She's repping her colors right here. Show them your shirt. It's so cute. I can't. <laughs> So I am a Ravenclaw. So last week I had my Ravenclaw inspired look go up. I am a Ravenclaw, so I started with that. Kylie is a Hufflepuff, so this week we're going to be focusing on Hufflepuff colors, which are on the internet defined as canary yellow and black. So she's got that going on here. Got it going on. Got it going on. <laughs> this might be kind of weird because she is almost 14. And I'm gonna do some pretty dramatic eyeshadow on her. So this is not something I would recommend her wear out. No. This is just for fun. Mm, yeah. <laughs> I don't wear makeup for people that wear makeup. For people that, that are, I mean some people wear makeup at 14, but she doesn't. So anyways, instead of doing this makeup on me, I'm gonna do it on her since she is a Hufflepuff. Okay, well, so we're going into this. I have no idea what I'm doing yet. <laughs> so I'm just gonna break out the bright color, colorful colors. <laughs> What? For the Ravenclaw, I had shadows in my collection that I could use, but for all the other houses, I did not have what I needed because they're bright, bright different colors. Well, I mean, green and yellow. And well, and Gryffindor is like red and yellow, dark red and yeah, that one gold. will be interesting. And gold. gold. So that gold. that that's gold. gold. Anyways, so we went to Ulta and I picked this up today. This is the BH Cosmetics Take Me Back to Brazil palette. This has some. Um, Ooh, color. Wow. So it definitely has a canary yellow in here yeah. that we can use. Uh, wow. This is pretty much just gonna be yellow and black. Yeah. All right, we've done a lot of talking. We're gonna stop now. We can never stop talking, huh? Mm -mm. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and get her eyes prepped and then we will go into the demo. I'm probably gonna zoom in on her so you don't see me. Uh, it's been a long day. This is kind of a last minute video, so I did not get myself all dolled up. This is just the, my rainy day self. Rain, yes, rain, 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 rain. That's rain. why our hair is kind of whoop. Okay, let's zoom in. So Kylie's eyes are prepped and we are diving into this. So if you look at Kylie's eyes, she has very, very, very small lid space. Um, so this is going to be a challenge and I'm going to have to use small brushes. All right, so I'm going to start with the palest yellow shade and I have this little bitty brush. Um, I think my plan is to put the yellow all over her lid and into her crease and then do some black on the outer edge. So we're gonna start and see what this pale yellow does. Nothing with this brush. Okay, let's try this brush. And since I'm putting this basically everywhere, I'm gonna use a little bit bigger brush so it doesn't take us 10 years. <laughs> it burns. Okay, when you laugh, I can't do your eyes. Because <laughs> they disappear. <laughs> okay, so this light yellow is just a very light wash of yellow, which is okay because I need this to be um, transitioning. All right, look at the, look at the, look at the. I'm gonna put this in your face. <laughs> <laughs> Next. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna take this um, medium or shade. We're everywhere. Yep. That one has a little bit more of a color payoff than the last one, and um, so the yellow is showing up better. Yeah, I can actually see it. Your eyes are closed. You can't see anything. <laughs> you rolled your eyes. You almost got stabbed in the eye. Okay, now I'm going to go in with the deepest yellow shade and kind of just deepen up the outer bit and into the crease. We're going to start deepening the crease a little bit. This yellow is not obviously going to deepen it much, but it is going to intensify that color. Okay, so next I'm going to take the black shade. I have not used this, so I don't, ooh, ooh it's soft. I don't know how it performs. Yeah. So let's see how this works. Um, I'm gonna, all right, so I'm going to take this little detail brush into the black, and I'm going to dot this on the outer corner ever so gently because like I said, there's not a lot of space here. So I want to put this exactly where I want it just to deepen up this outer corner, just like, oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, this little bitty brush I use to do my inner corner highlight, but on her, it's 
perfect for this outer corner. Here, Lincoln. Mm -hmm. So I'm doing kind of like an outer V on her. So I want to keep that lid space open. And then I'm going to slowly just pull that through a little bit. Okay, look at me. So now I'm going to take this really fluffy blending brush and I'm going to just blend out the edges of that black. So I want it to be a little bit softer. Okay, look at the camera. <laughs> so I'm going to take that same big fluffy brush put it into that darkest yellow shade and kind of use it to diffuse the edge and bring back some of that yellow we lost. Just continuing to blend and make everything smooth like a smoothie. <laughs> All right, look at me. And I'm pulling this black kind of up and out a little bit to kind of start that wing effect and then we will go in and do winged liner with this but I want that black to kind of go with it yeah girl I feel like the outer edge of this eye the eyeshadow doesn't want to stick and it just keeps blending away Woo! look at that girl all right we are not done we have one more step all right, I'm going to take my Alomar Cosmetics brush and I'm going to go into this shade. This is just a transformative shade. You put it over any of the colors and it just adds some it's shimmery. This, huh? It's just hands. <laughs> it just is um, anyways, so I'm going to take this and I'm going to wet it with some setting spray and apply this to her lid. All right, so this should keep the yellow color, but just make it shiny and perte. Um, so with the brush, it didn't really help me. So ooh, I'm just gonna put it on my finger and tap it. Ooh. See, my finger's too big. Okay, I'm gonna use my little finger. <laughs> and tap it on the lid. That's better. All right, see the difference? It brings a little bit of to her lid. Do you like that noise? Mm hmm Okay. Uh, I'm gonna get a wipe and clean up the fallout and I do like a sharp wing there and we'll be right back. All right, so I cleaned up the fallout on her eyes and kind of cleaned up that line. We're going I also put on some primer on her face. It's the Too Faced Hangover Primer. I am going to take my Benefit Hello Happy Foundation. Hello Happy. And again, I know she is 14. This is not something she's gonna wear out. We're about to go to bed, but uh, I want to do the complete look. So, we're going to put some foundation on this beautiful little face. Hello. Do you feel pretty? <laughs> On this way. Next, I'm going to take the ColourPop No Filter Setting Powder and I'm just going to set the face. Next up, I'm going to take the Laura Geller Baked Blush and Brighten in Tropic Hues. I feel sorry for you because you have to edit this video. It's okay. I love you. Hmm. <laughs> Just a little bit of rosy back into her cheeks that we just covered up. <laughs> All right, we're gonna bronze you, baby. Okay, so this is the Physician's Formula Butter Bronzer. I had to buy a new one because Lincoln destroyed my other one. It smells like a vacation. It's a vacation in a compact. Yeah, okay. <laughs> yeah, okay. Oh, you're putting that on my brows too. This is the Tanya Crooks 
brow gel. Um, this will hopefully darken the areas I want in so you don't see the other ones as much. Well, you've got a lot down here too. I know that, but that's because I, yeah. I know. It's they not, grow so they quickly do. and I don't want to wax every week. I know. And plucking under there's not fun either. Oh no, I know. I, I, I put it off as long as I possibly can. All right, next we're gonna do a winged eyeliner. Now, uh, she has, again, very, very tiny eyes. So I'm gonna do this real quick and come right back because I don't know how long this is gonna take, so. <laughs> that took a little bit of work, but um, doing eyeliner that thin is, is actually quite difficult and on somebody else. But I put a little bitty wing on her. Um, so like I said, she's got little eyelids and I put a little bit more of that white um, topper right in the center just to make her eyelids pop a little bit more. So now we're gonna go to the lower lash line. We are, all right, so I'm taking that darkest yellow shade and I'm sorry, you're gonna have to look up. This is the, it feels weird. I know, I know, it's the first time, you know, and so it's gonna, she's gonna blink a lot, I'm sorry. I'm being very, very gentle though. I am just, I'm sorry. <laughs> Does it hurt? No, it doesn't hurt, it okay. just feels weird. Yeah. And then I'm gonna take the black shade and go just on the very outer edge of her lower lash line. I think since her, her um, eyes are so tiny, I'm gonna go in with an angled brush instead of that smudger brush. Go. Yeah, that's easier. I'm sorry, sweetie. No, that's fine. <sighs> <laughs> okay, so now I'm just gonna take a brush and so I'm just going to blend out the black a little bit with this. I'm gonna do this as quick as I can. There you go. Okay, so I'm gonna take that white topper shade and see how it does on its own. I'm gonna bring it down on the lower lash line in the inner corner. Good, and then I'm gonna get just the inner corner right here with that shade as well. Just to bring some light right here. Okay, so the battery died, but luckily I had a spare. We're almost done. I just have to do those lashes. I feel okay? Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm gonna take my Tarte Lights Camera Lashes. Good job. What color should we do on your lips? Man, you look so pretty. Ooh, that's pretty. Okay, so I'm gonna take the Tartus, the Tartus Glossy Lip Paint in Goals. Goals. Such cute little dupes. <laughs> All right, the final step, setting spray. I'm gonna take the Catrice Prime and Fine Dewy Fixing Spray and squirt her face. You ready? Mm-hmm. Fan it off, fan it off. Shake it off, shake it off. All right, guys, this is the final Hufflepuff look. What do you think? I like it. Did I do Hufflepuff proud? Mm-hmm. It looks really good with your shirt. Like, I like it. <laughs> Never had this much makeup on before, so does it feel weird? A little. No. Should we take a picture and send it to mom? <laughs> oh. Why did you not tell me my bangs were messed up, people? They can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> wow, you're so pretty. <laughs> All right, so that is the finished look. We are done. We are gonna go chill, probably have some popcorn, watch a movie, yes. have some girls time. With Lincoln. <laughs> With Lincoln. <laughs> All right, guys, thank you so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed this. I hope it was uh, entertaining. And we still have two parts left of this four part series. So we have Gryffindor and. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> you look so old. She said too old. Yeah. You look too old, <laughs> is what my mother says. <laughs> I don't know what I was saying. Oh, so Gryffindor and Slytherin. I'm um, not sure who I'm gonna be doing those on yet. I may do them both on me. I may have friends, we'll see. If you like this, please give it a thumbs up. Um, thumbs up. If you like Kylie, please give her a heart in the comments for please me. Please love me. Please love me. <laughs> give me a blue heart. Yes. <laughs> um, and if you haven't already and you wanna see future videos, hit that subscribe button down below. <laughs> All right, guys. I hope that you have a wonderful day and we will see you next time. Stay gorgeous. Bye. Bye. And subscribe to this face. <laughs> to this face, not this face. <laughs> <It's> so <great. laughs>
<laughs> subscribe to this face. <laughs> subscribe to, to, to this loveliness. My <laughs> loveliness, she's so sweet. <laughs> um. <laughs> and, uh, what's the word? Blend it. <laughs> like, are you trying to say blend the word um, you really blend like? out that lower block? Blah blah. blah. <laughs> My sister cannot talk today. It's late. At, it's only six o'clock. It's only six o'clock. That doesn't seem very late to me. I'm old. Okay. We needed it. Needed it. Dad would hate this. Yeah, Dad no, would we'll hate this. No, Dad will be like, she looks too old. Yes. We are blending. Always blending. Blending forever and ever and ever. Da da. <laughs> I'm gonna take this little detail. <laughs> Why do you keep moving things slowly? Like. That is, that, that is yellow. She is speechless. <laughs> She was trying to say pig. Wow. <laughs> She's turning red. She's laughing so much. Here we go. Fan her off. Fan her off. And, um, you know, for older people. <laughs> that sounded weird. <laughs> that didn't sound. That didn't. We need, I'm going to get a.